Well, I see the chamber uh, from a unique set of eyes in that I ran the chamber, you know, 20 years ago. And so I know the incredible value that the chamber brings to a community, whether it's in helping to build businesses, to bring businesses together, to strengthen our economy, and really to address problems as they come up in the community. And that can be a problem of image. It could be a problem of infrastructure. You, any need that the community has, it, it affects the business community, and so it affects the chamber. And the chamber looks for ways to solve problems. It's a huge help for the chamber to uh, to speak for us. We we get to go to uh, certain meetings and things like this. But the chamber is always out there. Every legislator, senator, and representative, and the governor's office are very aware of, of the impact and how powerful the chamber is throughout the state of Illinois. And Decatur has a great reputation for being a huge supporter of the Chamber of Commerce. They allow certain tax issues to, to, uh, to not be in, in, in impacting our local business. On a small business, we couldn't go over it and talk to those legislators and have the powerful voice that we have without having the Chamber backing us up. Well, DLI is a program that allows uh, other area leaders to go through and kind of find out what the uh, some of the core industries of Decatur are, what holds this town together, and it really delivers uh, a message, well I guess two messages, one of which is uh, what can we as leaders of the community do for these industries that are so you know vital to the community. The second of which is to, uh, to really just find out you know what these, uh, these industries are so it really helps somebody who hasn't been here uh, change their story, I guess that's the, the narrative. Uh, is what it, what does DLI do to change the way you view Decatur? Well, I call on the chamber regularly, uh, both for, from the mayor's role. Miranda and I have traveled to Washington, D.C. together trying to lobby for money for infrastructure projects. And that's an, a joint effort of the Chamber of Commerce and business and labor and government all joining forces to try and bring federal dollars back to our community. In my work life through Decatur Memorial Hospital, uh, we regularly depend on the chamber when we host events to highlight different things that are happening at our business. So I know the value in uh, what the chamber can bring to the table and its membership and in just getting the word out about issues that are important to this community. The database of individuals who are part of the chamber, their businesses and their employees, um, it's a way to reach a large number of people in our community to show them how together we can be stronger. Um, what was really great is when I went through DLI, uh, it really did changed the way that I viewed the city and changed the narrative that I told other people uh, about how I feel about this city. And I thought that was, a, when I really look back, at, you know, that's really important for me to go and be a leader of the city, at this, to have a positive message, because this is really is a great place to live. Uh, and so being able to see all these different things, to find out what's so special about the sound was really meaningful to me. One of the things I'd like to say is that the Greater uh, Decatur Chamber of Commerce is a great value. We have, uh, it has impacted our bottom line in so many ways. So I would urge everyone to be involved in the Great Indicator Chamber of Commerce, not only from your local aspect, but also from your networking aspect, and also how it impacts your bottom line for each business, big and small.